This is a moving UI in Game Builder Garage. Or I should say, this can be used to make a UI in Game Builder Garage. Right now, it's just a box with numbers going upwards, but it does have all the pieces necessary to make an actual UI. Like, you can attach the health bar to this box, and then you will always know the health of the player because it moves with the player. And it doesn't have to be one lonely little box, you can show many different things to the player by attaching many different boxes and text objects and number objects so that the player has a ton of information right at their fingertips. Now, let's learn how to create this. So let's start with the player character, and the thing that I want to show you is that we really didn't do anything too crazy. We have these two Joy-Cons, that, or Joysticks rather, that go into the person, and none of these numbers have been changed. Everything is perfectly normal, and is just how it would be if you placed down a fresh person node on and attached the controls to it. What? When it gets interesting is when we go over to the number node on. So we can see that it is actually attached to a secondary person node on. And this person node on has the exact same controls as our first one that the player uh, can actually see. So that is how the number node on moves exactly with the player character because they have the exact con controls and the number node on is, con is connected to the person. And wh what we have done is that we have turned the turning speed to zero, so that means that it cannot turn. Because if we didn't do this, then when we were going upwards, then we wouldn't be able to see the number because it would be like upside down, and that's not good. But by making the person unable to turn, then we ensure that the number node on will always be able to be seen. And this, in case you're wondering, is how I made it so that the number node on constantly goes up. A constant goes into a timer, which goes into the counter, and the counter goes back into the timer. So yeah, that is basically all of it. This is how to make a UI in Game Builder Garage, and I hope this was helpful.